quick reminder that this will be our final qualification match before lunch. And right now we are 10 seconds left in auto. 49-26, Galactech has successfully engaged at the end of Autonomous for their Alliance. 2197 appears to have docked for the Blue Alliance. It is currently 15 to 6, advantage to the Red Alliance, still very close early in this one at the start of our driver operated period. Las Pumas with their adorable robot successfully grabbing a cone from their human player station to take across the field, probably dodging defense bots to score. 4982, their alliance partners, Olympus Robotics, is getting ready, preparing to score a cube in one of the nodes in their alliance's grid. 910, over on the right side of the lines, Foley Freeze does just that, successfully scoring, scoring a cone on the high grid, which will net another five points for the Red Alliance. Moving with impressive, impressive speed across the field, a cycle time of what feels like a few seconds. Successfully scores the second of what will be another third game piece needed for a link and the bonus points associated. Back over on the blue side of the field, 6956 Shamrock Botics with the luck of the Irish successfully have scored two game pieces into the high nodes, getting them that much closer to a link. Along with a successful improv act, they relieve Las Pumas of their cone to successfully score it on a medium node should they succeed. 4982 unfortunately appears to be motionless at the moment. There's 35 seconds left in the match, plenty of time to fix it. Let's hope they get things going again. 4926 just near me, Galactech preparing to get themselves into the final position for the end game. Shamrock Botics instead electing to grab another cone and attempt to score it to give the Blue Alliance the edge with 13 seconds left. Still plenty of end game points on the table. This one is not over yet. Sloop Dog along with their partners in Shamrock Botics have both successfully docked and engaged. 9-10, the Foley Freeze attempting to engage at the final moment. Unfortunately, they slide off. Let's take a look at our scores. It's the Red Alliance. Winning decisively 58-41 two only one of their teams actually will enjoy a rise in rank into the top 20 that will be valuable points still for all three teams <laughs>